Welcome back to Bentan Omniverse 2, where I, in the last episode, found out that there's actually three more levels to finish. Uh, there's level 5, level 6, and then a final level. I don't know what that's supposed to entail. It might actually be a boss fight that is actually any fun at all. But I'll just continue to try and play the best of my ability but for now we'll just try and experience uh this new chapter with azimuth explaining what it is that i need to look out for even though that i look out for the exact same thing every single time the core of the problem i just gotta get this thing to the power core mm. greetings ben tennyson hey yeah just like old times you, me, in an alien closet. Once you activate the power decay transducer, you must get off the ship quickly. Got it. Get to power core, use device, run. All right. Yes. Hold to the frag. <laughs> Sounds easy enough. I uh, just got to look out for one thing and that's it. I guess I save over this one just in case. But before. Before I head out, who was it that was new for me? Oh yeah, Accelerate. Accelerate and... Grav Attack. Uh... And then Mid Class... Oh wait, no, Mid Class was just these few. Don't quite remember who the other Heavy was supposed to be. Let's see. So, everyone's attacks. Grav Attack, Jump, obviously. Planet Form Block, uh-huh. Fly swatter attacks, smashing, yeah. Okay. Teleport blur is accelerates B. The light class seems to have like the best, like, blocking. Oh yeah, and I don't think I ever tried Big Chill's um block ability. It's about to get cold. What's his like? Or hers? Okay, so it turns him invisible? Maybe I just won't get hit or something I don't know uh then accelerate. accelerate if I press B oh what uh that's not what I wanted yes I want to get out of here oh you can constantly hold B and teleport to a different area gotcha well, that might be fun and yours, I, yep, is the exact same as the last time. So, I guess I'll try and head out with this. But there's one thing that I wanted to talk about. Uh, if I select the level, and if you go back through uh, each thing, which also tells me how many levels there are. Uh, this is being five, and the next one is six, obviously. And then a final one, which uh, in the achievements doesn't say level seven. It just says beat the game or something. And that's the point that I'll switch it to hard or something. Um, if you go back through, you can see how many of the collectibles there are for the Omnitrix things. I only missed one in Welcome to Earth and then nothing else. So I'll try and explore some more with uh, the core of the problem. But uh, don't hold me to everything that I say. Because I'm trying my best. It's a bit jarring to try and fight with, uh... Oh, yeah, I forgot about that thing. Oh, God. I'm already that low. Jesus. Uh, how does your block work? Interesting, but does this use any power? No, it really doesn't. But they still know where you are, which is the big issue. Let's make this 
Okay. <laughs> Gotta get out. What? Ah, I just switched to grab attack. Come on. God damn it. Just work. That's all I want is one thing to work properly. Still pretty tough on my own. Uh-uh. Not gonna happen. Ah, damn it, this game sucks. What? Alright, I'm just gonna get more energy as soon as this comes back. There we go. And that's it. Alright, before I go anywhere else, I'm immediately getting Crash Hopper back. I'm returning to Azmuth immediately. Whenever I need a new hero, I'll come back and do it, I guess. But Crash Hopper is the uh, main line of getting rid of people. Um, grab Attack, I haven't seen much of, so I'll try and keep him. And uh, Big Chill, I haven't seen much of either, so I'll leave it as is. But Accelerate, I'm afraid, but Crash Hopper's just too much better. Intruder! Intruder! I have to get to the alarm! Yeah, yeah, I see ya. What? He switched as soon as I became Big Chill. And it ruined the one thing that I had going for me on that throw. I don't want- I don't understand what the yellow ones are about. That appear sometimes. Yeah, I got some of it. Just now. But I still have to work on, uh... Big chill. Trying to keep on hitting him. This is the only fun addition that you get to do only every once in a while. I think I finally figured out when you can actually, like, hurt this guy. It's when that little exclamation point appears uh, in the top right whenever you're chasing him. And I didn't figure that out the last time. Where am I headed to now? Oh, I barely got that. And first enemy room. Not gonna happen. I'm just... Like I said before, Crash Hopper is just too good of an ally to not use. Ah, oh, shit. And he fell. <laughs> Ooh. What are you? I don't... Oh, yeah, I remember you. I fell. Come on. Stop being stupid. Weird that I haven't seen a second one of those biggins spawn again. Prepare for some shock and awe. Um, nothing there, and that's the correct path. But I'll go this way. Time to have some fun. Hmm. First getting rid of ice. 
immediately getting rid of you. Oh my god, all of them. Ouch, that did some damage. This isn't going to be slow roasting. I wonder what happens if I switch in the air. No, I guess I can't switch in the air. Because switching to grab attack would be kind of fun. I'll deal with you guys now. <laughs> Free damage. My god. These guys are actually pretty decently strong. Hey! First one down. Not much to worry about now. Come on. Yeah, I think he's finally showing some wear and tear. Because he's starting to spark. Which I don't think I realized in the last time. Ooh. And who are you for? Drive attack and level 2. Uh, so X, X? Wait, X, 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 right? The exact same attack from the previous game. Y, Y. Same exact attack from the previous game. Yay. Alright. Take it nice and slow before we barge into the next thing. Uh, why was that dark? Goodbye. Oh, I didn't realize that there was a mine there. Nope. I am not letting you guys get the first attack. And what are you? Are you guys the smoke grenades? Yep. The harder they try. Time to spring into action. Ah, damn, we both missed. <laughs> Ouch. Next, go ahead. Uh, there's one that way, but it's dark in this direction. But I guess you can't go that way. I don't know if that's just like an issue with the game or like I literally just can't go that way. Uh oh. Let's see what you got. What? I used my cricket ability and I got out of there. No more. I can just knock you off. That's fine. Uh-uh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Just letting them kill themselves. I wonder if it does count as actually getting rid of them, though. And it, uh, if it'll count toward the achievement of getting rid of them. That's the only issue that I have with not killing them fully you need to take down the three security officers in this area to access the ship's power core each bridge leads to one of the security officers guarding the power core you will need to defeat each one to access that part of the ship yeah yeah i think i have a handle on this these guys are a little different they have some sort of incursion incendiary devices so you're saying they're hot stuff anyone Oh, come on, that was good! 
So I can go in any direction, but apparently this is the oh, right one, maybe. Oh, what the hell? Maybe now you realize the gravity of the situation. Yeah, I, I've I've finally understood. Uh what the exclamation point is about. Oh, that was close. I nearly got the wind knocked out of me. I wonder if that still counts as getting hit by damage because I'm right next to him. I barely dodged that one. Okay, now what? It's not telling me which way to go. Did they not think this far ahead or something? Okay, there's another one done. I'll go from the very beginning. He's after me. Get those doors open. I better put him on ice quickly. The only issue is that he doesn't run very fast, so you can get him like right off the bat. Time to stop this guy. He doesn't like to switch routes, unfortunately, so this isn't as fun. The first one was a lot better than this. Oh, and I just randomly switched. I just got lucky doing that. Oh wait, but this one has secrets. What? Okay, I'll go back through the other one and see where the secrets are for that area as well. Yikes. Immediately trying to get rid of anything that can kill me. As much as it's kind of cheap just to continue using these abilities, I don't really mind. The game isn't fun. It's Subway Surfer at its worst, and at its best, it's barely combative. Uh-uh. Not getting near that. I made the mistake of hanging on for way too long. Poof. I got rid of both of them. Nice. Got them in one attack for each. Ah, oh, there's still more. I don't know which one to target first is the issue. I'm thinking it's this one because he spawns the most. And the gold one I've only seen the previous time. And that was at the end of the level. So I'm not entirely sure if I'm still... Targeting the right person first. Hey, there we go. First one done, and then this one should be finished up soon. Ugh. Nice. And there's the second one. Damn it. I nearly got him. Second one done, and then this is the final one that I can just take out by its by itself. Come on! How strong are you? 
There we go. Accelerate is now level two. Um, let me head back to the other room, I guess. Yeah, there's no more hidden things there. So we'll go here. And then... Oh, you can't go back through them? What? Heavy duty. Yeah. Well, that's dumb. So did I miss my chance because the game wouldn't... Swinging tell you that there's more to be had? Come on. The only issue is that once they once he starts throwing it, he can't switch in between whether it's um paths or uh character. I see you now, Froggy. Come on. Anything's better than just doing nothing. And two more. Does my appearance bug you? Ah, come on. Just because I switched. Yeah, that's my bad. But it's fine. I guess I'll just run through it. Because I think there's only one hidden uh, thing throughout the entire area for all of this. Um, can I actually see anything? So this path has nothing. Uh, that path had the hidden thing. And this is forward progression? I don't know. And then these guys are pretty easy to deal with, and the lasers don't do that much damage. Go bigger, go home. A Any of the tanky characters, or- oh god! Like these. <laughs> the heavies are a little bit- Difference when trying to deal with them. and get rid of you first because he's facing the other direction and he won't turn. Don't mind if I do. Oh, just you. <laughs> Easy one, two. Kinda. Okay. Right. Where to next? Coming up to the security hallway. You're almost at the power core. Okay, thank you, but there's the two hidden items. Is full of impenetrable security measures. You might want to disable some of those by diverting down either or both of the side passages. Okay. I mean, Each I was one of these pressure pads and track switches disables or mollifies one of the measures in the security hallway. Whatever works, I guess. Or whatever doesn't work is what I should be saying because I'm trying to make uh, whatever works right now not work. Or something. The story is... It's not memorable, unfortunately, so I, I don't bother trying to follow what Azmuth has to say and what my current objective is. I'm just trying to get the collectibles, and that's literally all that it is. 
Just collectible, collectible, collectible. There we go. Next. Alright, that's one switch, but there's two switches to do. Gas grenades, gotcha. Ah, they're all gas related. Surprised that they didn't add a yellow one in for these turrets if they're gonna shoot gas grenades as well. Look what I can do. Hmm. Gas, then freezers, and then fire's probably gonna be next. Ouch! God damn it. At least you guys don't attack much after freezing me. It's all your friends that can do the damage afterward. Another one of these, for whatever reason. Come on, just switch properly. Is that one of the switches that I need to change? What? I'm so confused because they're... It affects what path you're going on or something. But then what are all the floor switches about? What do they actually affect? Because I haven't seen anything get changed. I'm just told that it changes something. But I haven't seen anything change is the issue. And I don't know like if I'm not affecting anything yet or like i've already affected something that i haven't seen yet oh god okay now i understand how annoying i am with these enemies just being able to hop around the entire time oh god I'll call you a brute, because that's exactly what you are, unfortunately. Ouch! I can't see, thank you very much. Oh. They're pretty easy to take a uh, kill if you just constantly use the heavy attack. Is this the end of that batch? Hey, another one of these. Bullfrag. Now level three. Tastes like chicken. Get ready to write your orbituary. How many of these pads are there? Okay. So I guess there's something hidden this way too, which is probably going to be another one, which kind of sucks if that's the only thing that's hidden instead of like switches that it says that are supposed to be available. Run, 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 run. <laughs> I was still frozen in mid-jump, or slowed. Iced? Frozen and iced I'd consider would be different. That's one thing that I think, like, should be, uh, an evasion sort of thing. Like, if you walk through, like, the tear gas, like, as, a uh, Crash Hopper, or, um, uh, Big Chill in his invisibility mode, or Astrodactyl, like, I think one thing that would make it better is if, uh, the tear gas actually followed you so your character was more susceptible to being damaged. Ouch. <laughs> Next. Get ready to write your orbituary. Marathon, man. Oh yeah, that's when I uh have run an actual marathon. Oh. 
Oh, there's two of you. Great. Kind of good that this one, uh, like, stuns them continuously. Uh, why does he have a red ring around him? Has that always been there? Oh, yeah, I guess so, if I look at, um, Crash Hopper. I guess I just thought that it was there, like, whenever I was landing, just to let me know where he was going to land. Not, he'll always let me know that he's there. <laughs> Oh god! More of these! <laughs> More of the gold ones. It's interesting. Ouch! How many of the- How many heavy attacks do these guys need? Is what I want to know. I just wish that they would separate out a bit more. I'm just really glad that you can, like, walk around them, uh, where their shield isn't, and still do damage to them. Because that's, like, the one thing that would make- that makes them a lot better of an enemy to withstand. Oh yeah! Incursions advance! Ooh, wait, can they shoot their own teammates? Is that a thing? Nice. And now through here, I guess. Big chill. I barely got that one. Get him. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> Ouch. Just work the right way. That's all I ask. I tried to attack with grab attack, and he immediately goes where no one is. And for some odd reason, grab attack's like the only person that doesn't want to work correctly when fighting, which sucks because he was he was the most fun to use in the previous game, and now he's like the least valuable to me now. I, I dodged the hell out of that, uh, tear gas grenade because of an accidental ground pound. <laughs> we both just kept hitting each other midway. Is that doing any damage to any of them? I don't think so. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh. Big Chill has successfully been upgraded to level 3. And that's... I'm cool like that. So what is it? I hold X. Uh, that probably freezes a bunch of people. And Y does what? Oh. Kind of like Diamond Head's old thing. Barely got that one across because I didn't know it was there. Oh, come on. Why would you design it like that? Okay, so does that mean that I can just press onward? And is that all of them for this level now that I think about it? <laughs> oh, I guess you have to complete the level first before you can know. See, like, how do you... God damn it. That's the only one that I've ever dodged out of those things. I've never dodged any of them. What the so, hell? So, here it is, the power core. It's just you and me. And you guys. Psh. 
That was unnecessary damage that I didn't need. Free kill. So do I need to destroy these things or something? Or what? Do I need to destroy something? I'm not sure exactly what's going on. To be perfectly honest. Do I just need... Get out of here. Oh god, I nearly sent myself flying. Get lost. Oh god. Ah, one of everybody. Nice, everybody's joining the party. Oh wait, I guess the tear gas one does have a little bit of a color difference versus the green standard one. No! Oh yeah, I forgot that it doesn't kill you like the other games. God damn it. I don't mind falling off the edge with some of them, but with all of them, it's annoying. Uh-uh. The ones that are away from the rest. I'll happily... Jesus. I'll happily target. Oh. One of them fell off themselves? No, God. Fuck you. Oh. That's what it does. Nice. <laughs> Thank you for just falling off. Uh-uh. Next. Ow. Ah, perfect. You have unlocked the malfunction arena challenge. Where's the on switch? Huh, come to think of it, I don't think Azmuth told me how to use this thing. So are we gonna blow up the universe or something? And that seems to have done something. Time to get out of here. Agreed. Level completed. No time for sightseeing. Available? Cannon Bolt has been unlocked. That's the extra hero. The last heavy. Infiltrate and exterminate. Or just infiltrate and exterminate. You know. I'm an idiot like that, okay? I don't really mind. But, that being said, this is all that this episode was. 40 minutes of me just trying to get through it. And that's what the rest of these episodes are going to be. One more level of something and then another level of something else well probably one one more level of this and then one last level of probably this again but hopefully they'll at least change up the last level a little bit but i'm not i'm not giving this any benefit of the doubt it's going to be the exact same oh well have a nice day